Learning more tonight about a weekend shooting that claimed the life of a high school basketball player. We first told you about this case Sunday night, and now we're hearing from loved ones about this loss. Yeah, it's a tough one. WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pierre is live in Uptown. Jesse, you spoke to the family members, of course, and other people in the community here. What have you heard from both sides? Well, folks are hurting after learning that a 14 year old lost his life so young in such a devastating way. I'm told he was actually just coming back from a birthday party before he was shot and killed. Oh, he's nice, baby. He, he was a nice guy. Family mourning the loss of 14 year old Johnny McClendon, a teen who they say had dreams of being a star. The teen played for the Garinger High School basketball team and he went to school with Alvin Jacobs daughter. The conversation, they were so their spirit, right? It was so respectful. And I don't mean like with respectability politics, it wasn't yes or no, sir. It wasn't just that their demeanor was so calming. On Sunday night after 730, McClendon's grandma said she was cooking when she heard a large sound coming from the upstairs floor. When I heard something pop and I said, what is that? And he was saying that, oh, uh, got shot, but I didn't know. I thought it was his brother, but it was Johnny. CMPD says officers responded to the North Charlotte home where they found the teen dead. Police tell us he was shot in the head. Will Adams, a community activist, says he was stunned to hear the news. When I spoke to the father, um, you know, I went to greet him, shake his hand, and he, you could see the hurt, the pain, and tears all in his face and his eyes. And he was telling me he couldn't shake my hand because he literally had blood on his hand because he was cleaning up his son's blood. The incident raising many concerns and questions about kids and their access to guns. You know, everybody stop sugarcoating and call it, for, call it what it is. I mean, we, we have a sickness with these kids and these guns and they able to do this and do that in social media. Devastating, frustrating, um, I'm angry, right? Because it feels like our community, not just this neighborhood, but the city of Charlotte, right? Mecklenburg County, the state of North Carolina, United States of America, right? Um, we're dropping the ball with our kids. In a statement, CMS said in part, it is with a heavy heart that I inform you that one of our students, Johnny McClendon, died last night. We are heartbroken by this loss of life and we grieve with his family and friends. Now, this can be a confusing and challenging time, which is why CMS is offering resources to students, making counselors more visible on campus and available to them for anyone who needs to speak to one. Live in Uptown, Jesse Pierre, WCNC Sharp.